Just picking up some essentials, you know, a honey pomelo. Yeah, need one of them. Ugh. Look at that. This is a that is a beast. Yeah. Come on. I need all of those. Three. Yes, I got three. You you them Hi everyone. Hello. We're back. As you can probably tell, we're doing our food shop at the moment. Stop. What do we need? Steak. Look at all this meat. Are we getting steak? Yes. So what we tend to do is Lucy plans all our meals in advance. Then we make a list. Yeah. Come in. And buy all. Actually, I guess that's what most people do when they come shopping. <laughs> Except I don't get any help from someone else. Oh, there we are. There we are. Come on, come on. We need to get this home. You're not even helping. It's all right. Do you want me to push it? Yeah, then. Right. So we're gonna head back. You're going the wrong way. Oh yeah. There we go. So we're gonna head back now. Get all this shopping put away. And then, oh guys, the food. I know there's been a lot of food in these vlogs recently. Hope you're enjoying it. We are. <laughs> this is going to be another foodie vlog. You should have seen what Lucy has bought us for this it's afternoon. Like it. Chill out. it is. It, okay, if anyone likes cheese, have you heard of a cheese called camembert? Yes, you have. No, no, stop. So hang on, hang on. Sorry. How do you get a bear out of a tree that likes cheese? I don't know. Tell me. Camembert. Awful, awful. So Lucy came home the other night, we'd finished a long day at work and we thought we wanted a treat. And she came home with these, she'd been to M&S, she bought some tiger loaf and some camembert. But we were actually a bit too full from our dinner to eat actually, it that evening. Happened. I went out with my friends of an evening and ditched you, sorry. We didn't get to eat cheese. I wasn't gonna mention that bit. <laughs> yeah, so last night we were gonna have a nice evening in with some camembert, but then Lucy's yeah, friends, yeah. Summer, Beth and Megan, decided to steal Lucy away from me. Thanks for that. Can't say no. And yeah, she went out, so we didn't have the camembert, but it was fine. So then me being the nice boyfriend that I am, I decided I would drop her into town and then pick her up at three in the morning. Not three one, not two, this. three a.m. Three Can't get this key thing out. So look, you normally just put that back in there and that's supposed to pop out. <laughs> I couldn't get the key thing out. Why? It's broken. If it was a pound... Oh, I know! If it was a pound coin, yeah. are you gonna go and give it a go? If it was a pound coin, I'd be really annoyed. It, it will not come out. I like it. Oh. Yes, yeah. yeah, you know, it's over there. Look, it literally won't come out. I've tried it. I tried it over there as well. Okay. If that was a pound coin, how annoyed would you be? I'm even more annoyed at this. This is his memories. Oh, the trolley then. Yeah, we just have to take trolley with us. That's a pound. That's annoying. Where are we going to put oh, that? Yeah, yeah. We are home. We're back. Only out of breath. Those shoes should really go in there. We'll anyway. put them in there then. Okay, guys, something just happened. I'll need to get your advice on it, right? So, our neighbour let us in through the front door. So, to get into this building, you need a code and your key and all sorts of stuff. We were carrying all our shopping bags, so our neighbour let us in. He's French. We think he's French. So, he's definitely French. He said bonjour. So he said, we said hello, and he said bonjour, and then he held the next door for us as well, and he went thanks, and I went mercy. No, you went mercy, with a French accent. Yeah, obviously you do it in a... You're not in France. I did, I got a B in GCSE French, so I know what I'm doing. Irrelevant. Lucy's like, you cannot say that. It's weird, it was so nice, because it would have been fun if he said mercy back or something, or whatever, or replied in French. Give it to him. But the fact that you just went, he just went... He wouldn't have even thought about it, because to him that's just like someone saying thank you. Give me your sweets. Well, these sweets? Give me your sweets. Why, do you want them? You've got your own. <gasps> Why do you want them? Oh, for God's sake. Because, put them in the sweet bowl. Why oh, yeah. Nice, by the way? That's a good idea. Where's the sweet bowl gone? Up there. Why is that up there? I don't know, I moved it. It's so weird up there. It's Guys, here, it's yeah? four o'clock this morning. How you doing, by the way? Have we said a proper hello? Hope we have. Hope you're all doing very well. Hope you've had a nice week. Here. But won't they go, don't they need to be covered up? I don't really, I'll fry them away after I don't want to eat them the next week, so I'm again. Okay, yeah, put them in there. 
Now we've got loads of sweets. That's quite cool, actually. Oh, nice. So this morning we went to see my grandparents. Grandparents. And as grandparents do, they buy you sweets. So they gave us like so much pick and mix. It's four o'clock and that is all we've eaten today. So we're gonna make, we're a little bit jittery and shaky because all we're eating is sugar and sweets. So we're gonna make now That's some- biscuit base. Are you making them? What? Please make them. I make everything. Okay, I'll make them. We're making now some bacon and cheese toasties. I mean, we're gonna, the shopping like that. Okay, then we're gonna have our camembert in a bit. This is a cool angle. A couple of hours later now, I was oh, I was going to show you the time on this clock, but we haven't put any batteries in it yet, so I can't do that. It is 10 to 7. We've just been chilling here for a bit. This coffee table is a complete mess, but we've got our sweetie bowl, all our pick and mix. And oh my god, I went out to the shop last night to get some treats, and I got Magic Stars, standard. But this, oh my god, this stuff. This is what you need to get your hands on. Dairy milk, medley, dark chocolate chips, biscuit and fudge pieces. It's all gone, but it's the best thing in the world. When are we having our camembert? In a bit. Okay. The oven is now on and it's warming up nicely for me to put the camembert in it in a second. So that'll be yummy. We actually noticed recently one of you guys who always comment on our videos actually commented on our friend Nathan's video. Um, which brings me nicely on to talk about an exciting weekend we've got coming up. So Nathan Griffith has got a channel. Um, on YouTube. We always talk about his channel on here actually, and it's a really cool channel, he's a really cool guy and uh, we've literally met him through YouTube, like I don't know, how did we come across him? Did he comment on us or did we comment on him? I can't even remember, it's ages ago. I can't remember. No, anyway, so um, we've basically, we're always like chatting on YouTube and stuff and he's got a girlfriend called Fran Francesca or Frankie and um, they live in like Wales, yeah? Ish. Wales-ish apparently. Um, so they're coming down to stay in the flat for a weekend in a few weeks time, so that'll be really cool. And they've never been to Brighton, have they been to Brighton? No. They've never been to Brighton before, so it's going to be really exciting. No, don't get the table ready like that, babe, we'll just have it here, won't we? They've never been to Brighton before, or like sort of anywhere near here, so we're going to show them all of Brighton, take them some nice meals out. We're going to plan the whole weekend for them, do like an itinerary of like the best things we can do, and it's really cool. Um, and he's also got a load of like toys and stuff, so he's got like a drone, um, he's got loads of really cool camera gear, um, obviously he's got his GoPro as well. If you watch his videos, you'll see like he loves his drone, and I think some of the footage he gets is like unbelievable, so go and check him out. But, so um, he doesn't know it yet, but we're going to basically take some of his you look like a thug thanks it's cold in there we're gonna basically take some of his drone footage and put it into this vlog are we have you asked him i haven't asked him yet you can't but... do that <laughs> but i think it'll be cool <laughs> i'm sure he'll be cool with us taking a tiny weeny little bit of drone footage to put in this only like 20 minutes worth for you guys how cool would that be we've wanted a drone for ages yeah it'd be cool to try it out around here as yeah. well and then we can see actually where we use it the, the, the so. vlogs are gonna be so fun when he gets here we're gonna be like, there'll be like two days of vlogs on our channel and his channel. He'll so be here, sorry. Get ready for that, look out for it, I mean, a couple of weeks, get excited. He'll actually be the first guest we've got in the flat as well, so they'll be lying on here. Yeah, the first time we Do you think we'll all fit? Big like... Not all sleeping on this sofa. Not sleeping, lying, like chilling. Yeah, because then we've got a chair there. Who's going there? Well, me and Nathan will be like snuggled up on this bit of the sofa. No, me and Frankie will be snuggled up on this bit of the sofa. <laughs> <laughs> you two are like bros, aren't you? You're like best mates. The bromance is real. We need to talk them, sort them cables out, they're really annoying me. Yeah, I know. Do you want to hear some guitar? Yeah. I don't think I've ever played guitar in a vlog. Play something good then. Get your lighters out, guys. I'm going to serenade you. Okay. This is what we do on Sundays, just... It's like Nathan Griffith's hair, but a much messier version. Oh yeah. Oh guys, did you see on Twitter? I was asking you guys what we should put on this wall, and Nathan sent me 
a photo like cartooned of himself. He's like, that'll go perfectly. So I did a little edit. Look on my Twitter. Nathan, if you arrive at the house and it's actually on the wall, don't be too surprised. Why are you doing a self timer of the coffee I table? I didn't know it was on self timer. But why are you taking photos of the coffee it's table? Not even focus. Me. Let's have a look at that photo. Photo goals. Shut up. I, it wasn't even focus. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> George doesn't know how to use a camera. Bye. Do you know how to use my bye. Camera? Does anyone else say bye, Felicia? And if so, where does it come from? We've heard it before and we keep saying it. Bye, Felicia. But where does it come from? We still don't know, do we? I have no idea. If anyone knows, it's from like a TV program or something. I don't, I don't know. It's weird. Look at this feast. Got rosemary and garlic on the camembert. And we've got some tiger loaf that I've toasted as well with oil and some more garlic and rosemary. Yummy! Move your phone! Why did oh, you move it before? Sorry. Oh my god, guys, look at that. Is the biggest slice of bread I've ever seen. Oh my god. Oh, this looks absolutely incredible. Oh yeah, get the Instagram. Can you take one for me as well? Oh my god, that looks well good. Does it? Let's see. That cheese was so, so good, wasn't it? Amazing. It was amazing. My hair is getting so long. It's getting way too long. I'm gonna, I think the plan is to get it cut just before we go on holiday. So I'm gonna have like another five weeks of growing and then I'm just gonna have to get it cut for holiday because we're going to some hot, hot places. Anyway, I don't know what you do on Sunday evenings, but we meal prep. <laughs> meal prep, <laughs> is that really weird? <laughs> and we make a lot of mess. In here we have spinach, it's a whole bag of mixed spinach. berries, and pineapple. No, that's pineapple. Oh yeah, there's the pineapple it's juice. It's not big enough, basically. We're doing a few days worth. Yeah, we need like a huge Nutribullet like this big. I've also got social media down there, such as my Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Join me on those. I'll see you guys very, very soon. Thank you for watching. That video was so good. I just linked it on my Twitter. That was another worthy YouTuber who we've spoken about before, Ellie. Girl I know or used to know or she's friends with my sister or whatever. That was a really good video. 21 things I learned in 21 years. Go on my Twitter, the link's on there, have a watch. Everything she said was so true. Basically about how we're all just winging life. That's what she said more than that. Yeah, she said a bit more than that. That's what I took from it. Anyway guys, we are gonna end the vlog here. We're knackered. We hope you've had fun following us around today. Thanks for coming along. It's, mid oh, it's midnight and we've got work tomorrow. Yeah, I've got the dentist tomorrow. So you don't have work till later. So let's hope that I have a full bit of health. Last time you said my um, wisdom teeth were coming through and apparently that's a really painful operation to have if you have to have them sorted out. So I'm hoping he's gonna say, yeah, they've stopped. They've just stopped. We have a fun weekend plan next week. We're off to Oxford to visit some friends. So hopefully you'll be vlogging some of that. And in the meantime, there'll be some other videos coming yeah. up in the week. Some surprises. So thanks for watching today, guys. We really appreciate it. Leave us some comments. We'd love to chat to you more. Hi to Harrison, who we saw in Morrison's today. Hello. Hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel. Follow us on our social media. Link's all down below. And we'll see you very, very soon. See you next time. Bye. Bye.